Hello, in this video we will see how to use Django to save images in Cloudinary. If you deploy your Django app to Heroku, you can't save images. So we will use Cloudinary to save this problem. We can save 25 gigabytes of media files in Cloudinary for free. I will create a new folder for this project, Cloudinary. I will create virtual environment for my project. And I will install Django 3.1 for this project. I will use the command python -m Django start project media to create a project media. I will use cd media to access the fo to the folder of the project media. I will use the command manage.py start app to create a new app pictures. Open the folder settings.py and add the application pictures. We will run the server to check if the project works. Use the browser to access to the website cloudinary.com Click on Sign up for free to create a free account Log in to access to your account Cloudinary has documentation for different framework and programming language Click on Integrations SDKs and Django SDK. In terminal, use the command pip install cloudinary. Copy Cloudinary's Python classes and pass them to settings.py Copy Cloudinary configuration parameters In your Cloudinary account, on dashboard, you find the cloud name The API key and API secret. We will create a model to upload images to Cloudinary. I am using only one field, but you can use other fields if your model is for e-commerce product like the name of product and the price in terminal we will use the command manage.py make migrations and manage.py migrate to apply changes on database we will create a super user so we can use the model
On admin.py, we will use admin.site.register to the register the model picture so we can modify it in uh, Django administration. Click on media library to access to your images. If you use Cloudinary for the first time, I think you don't have images. In Django administration, I will add a new picture. The image was added successfully. Let's check on Cloudinary library. We see that a new image was added. I will create a view to show this image. The name of view is index and I will render a template pictures slash index dot html. In folder of Django application pictures, I will create a new folder templates. Inside templates, I will create a folder pictures. Inside pictures, I will create HTML file index.html. I will just write the title Cloudinary to test the, the template. We have to create a new URL for the view index. In urls.py, we will import views. On comment section, you find the way to write a new URL. The name of my view is index. The view works. Now we can use the picture of database. In view.py, we will import the model picture. Pictures equal picture dot object dot all. This command import all pictures saved in database. We will add context to render so we can use pictures in our template. In index.html, we will use for loop to show all pictures saved in our database. I saved only one picture, but I will save other pictures later. The SRC of image is picture.image.url. This is how to display an image. It is too big, so we will resize it. Let's try with 100 pixels. It's too small. Let's try 300 pixels. It looks okay. We will create another view that allows a user of our application to upload an image. The name of the view is load picture. And the name of template is load.html. In templates pictures, we will create a new HTML file load. In urls.py, I will add a new URL to this view. The view works. In settings.py, 
we will add Cloudinary to installed apps. Inside the folder of the application pictures, we will create a new file forms.py. We will import forms from Django and the model picture from models. We will create a class picture form for the model picture. Fields equal all, I have only one field. If you don't want to use all fields, you can create a list. In views.py, import picture form from forms and import this Cloudinary class. I will create an empty form. I will add it to context so I can use it in my template. In template, I will write the variable form. button show apps in our view that allow us to upload an image if you have many fields you can use form dot the name of field that you want to use to save the image in cloudinary we have to add an html element form to use template to upload images we have to add the statement load cloudinary We need a submit button. In views.py, we will modify the view load picture. If request.method equal post, form equal picture form with the argument request.post and request.files. If the form is valid, we will say form in database. And we will redirect the user to the home page. Let's try to upload an image. It didn't work, the method should be post and not get. The error is in load.html. It's method and not action. Let's try to upload an image to Cloudinary. We have to add onc tape to upload data on server. Now it should work. Let's try. We have a new image on the view index. In Django administration, we see that a picture object was created and we can see the new image on Cloudinary. I will upload another images. This is the end of this video. Take care.